So why is smooth fast? Let me explain using a concept that I call the traction unit number model. When a car is in a steady state, not accelerating, decelerating, or cornering, it's balanced, and all four tires have an equal load on them relative to their size. If you had a gauge that could measure traction right at the surface, at the tire contact patch, as the car moved down the track, you would find that with a balanced car, each tire had an equal amount of traction. In my example here, each tire has 10 units of traction for a total of 40 units of traction holding the car on the track. Now, as you know, when you put more load on a pair of tires, for example from weight transfer, they gain traction, as this load versus traction graph illustrates. And tires that have load taken off of them lose traction. But notice that it's not proportional. In other words, the tires with more load do not gain as much traction as the unloaded tires lose. So when your car goes around a corner and load is transferred to the outside tires, they gain traction. But the inside tires lose traction. And if you used our conceptual tire traction gauge again, this is what we'd find. The outside tires have gained traction. They now have 15 units of traction each. But the inside tires have lost grip. They now have only three units of traction, which means that now your car only has a total of 36 units of traction holding it on the track. Yes, just when you need it most, in a corner, you actually have less traction because your car is not as balanced as it once was. Of course, every time you brake, corner, or accelerate, you cause weight transfer, and your car has less traction because of that. That's the laws of physics in play. If you brake, steer, and accelerate smoothly though, you'll cause less weight transfer, and therefore have more traction. Perhaps more than the 36 in our example here. But if you're not smooth with the controls, and you're not looking far enough ahead, you'll upset the balance of the car even more, and perhaps end up with even less than the 36 units of traction holding you on the track. So why is smooth fast? Because a balanced car has more traction. And the more traction you have, the faster you can drive.